السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وأصحابه ومن ولا سيدة صفية رضي الله عنها was one of the mothers of the believers the Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم respected her so much and he loved her so much and he would show his love in a way that he treated her for example there is a report that it says that every time um, they travel together the Prophet Muhammad صلى الله عليه وسلم would first kneel on the ground so that Safiya could put her foot on his knee and ride the camel first. And the report also says that Safiya was so polite and respectful of the Prophet Muhammad that she actually refused to place her foot on his knee. And instead, she would place her, her knee over his knee and from that position climb on the camel. You know, Sometimes you don't have to say anything to your spouse to show that you care about them. You know, showing your love through your actions is an effective way to communicate. And communication is a, is a key ingredient of any successful relationship. You know, sometimes we just don't know what communication means. Or maybe we do, but we don't know how to communicate. And usually, you know, the, the, the question that is on the mind of each and every single one of us is how can I improve communication in my relationships? And I really think the answer to that is so simple. Talk. You know, talk. If you have a problem, talk about it. If you have expectations, talk about them. You know, do not assume that your spouse is a mind reader. You know, uh, in successful marriages, people talk. They talk freely, they talk openly, they feel safe sharing their thoughts, they feel comfortable expressing their concerns and their feelings, you know. And so, yeah, talk. Also, share your feelings, you know. They say in psychology, the best way to communicate is, to, is by sharing your feelings. And so, if you feel neglected, if you feel frustrated, if you feel angry, I really think that you must share that with your spouse. Also, Show him how you want to be. Show your husband how you want to be loved and how you want to be cared for. Show your wife how you want to be, um, how you want to be respected. You know, also share good feelings. You know, words, words of love and kindness. You know, words have power, as they say. You know, words like, I love you. Words like, things like, uh, you know, I'm grateful to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that, that you are in my life. You know, people need to hear that on a daily basis, you know, especially people in your in your household, you know. And so if you are not an expressive person, if you cannot really communicate through words, as we know from the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi example, you know, communication is not only verbal, but also nonverbal, you know, simple, kind gestures can make huge difference in your relationships. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless your homes, bless your relationships. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala send down mercy in your homes, give you intact, give you safe, healthy. Jazakumullah khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah.